Good day everyone. Today we are going to discuss about the top five careers in ICT for the future. According to the World Economic Forum on the Future of Work, 70% of current workforce will need reskilling to be able to fit in to the future of work. And if you are in the industry, if you are working in different industries, you really need to be able to reskill and upskill yourself in different courses in ICT that will help you to be relevant in the future. And today we are going to discuss the top five of such careers that you can actually embark on now to become the top notch in the future. But before we continue, please go and subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button so that you get notifications on new videos we upload on different areas of ICT that will help upscale you and make you relevant in the future. So the first of the careers we are going to discuss today is data and artificial intelligence. We all know that the whole world is run by data right now. And data is a new oil, as they say. In the sense that data actually helps us to be able to see patterns where we couldn't have understood what is happening. Data also helps us to make decisions. Data also helps us to be able to make projections and see how the future will look like. To be able to look at data and make sense of it and train data models to be able to make predictions is what is called machine learning. And machine learning actually brings in and makes a device to the computer to become quite intelligent. That's what is called what? Artificial intelligence. Right now, artificial intelligence and AI is actually making us to actually see different users, use cases. Example is driverless cars. You see a situation where because of data, because of the amount of data the computer can analyze, it can be able to drive itself from point A to point B without needing a human guidance. And the good thing is that the more the cars keep driving themselves, the better they become, because the more they have data to train the model better. And as it's gotten better, you will notice that at a point in time in the future, you will be drivers, because every car will have the ability to drive itself and transport you from point A to point B. Not just a single use case. There are different other use cases of AI. You will see a situation where probably you'll be able to do deliveries run by robots. So you actually want to deliver a cargo from A to B. You just put it in a drone and a drone takes it from A to B without needing any human guidance. This is the part where uh, the future is going to. And the future is also going to a situation where you also have the personal assistants that are powered by artificial intelligence. So instead of having human personal assistants, you have robots that are your personal assistants. And think robots that can even be able to predict your needs. So you can be able to wake up one morning and the robot will be able to predict that you need to get a toothbrush and your toothbrush has just finished. I have ordered it last night for you. So these are the kind of things that we are going to see with AI. And the future is going to become quite interesting with the full potential of artificial intelligence fully really utilized. It also means that with this new entrance of AI into our everyday life, it creates an opportunity for people who can be able to program and model this data. And the ability to program and model this data and make these predictions and create these artificial intelligence devices actually creates a whole new opportunities for you. Right now, there is a serious insufficient manpower in this area. And the ability to train yourself in these areas will actually make you to become um, very relevant in the future. It's one of the most lucrative careers, both now and in the future. Another career that is so important right now is cloud computing. With the proliferation of interconnected devices like your mobile phones, your computers, your smartwatches, and your smartphone devices, and even with the creation of multiple Internet of Things devices, you notice that they produce an enormous amount of data. This amount of data will need to be what uploaded to a computer that is in the space, that is, that is in the cloud. And this computer that is in the cloud needs to be able to manage the, the upload of this data and the retrieval of this data. Now, since all these devices will actually require a place to upload data and retrieve data, it actually makes cloud computing become the one of the most important careers for the future. Because someone has to have the ability to manage these servers that are being linked to from the cloud com computers. Somebody has to also be in charge of creating applications that run on these cloud services. 
And this makes this whole industry so important. Gone are the days where you also require just your normal devices that are at home. Most devices right now are connected to the cloud. And since they are connected to the cloud, so you notice that even your TVs are connected to the cloud to be able to enable streaming of films and movies. So it's a whole new area for people to explore. I think we are still scratching the surface because there's a whole need of, for engineers that should be able to manage this cloud infrastructure. And there are little or few people who are experts in this area. So it will actually be beneficial for the future having an expertise in cloud computing. Another area that is so important is product development. Product development actually encompasses or not only the user interface, the user experience, but also includes the marketing and uh, use cases for the product. And that is so important. Being able to design and develop a product from the idea stage to the place where it's in the market, it's so important. The future will also require so much innovation. And as much as innovation that is going to grow in the future will require a whole lot of product design and development. And having soft skill will actually make you so relevant because we know that as much as possible, there are so many products that are not yet designed and there are so many innovations that are still not yet out. So you having that skill and an ability to be a product designer or a user experience designer or even a product developer is so important. And this is a skill that which is in demand now and also it will be so much in demand in the future. And our fourth career we're going to also start discussing, which is going to discuss today, is content creation. And content creation is mostly our way we are discussing not just you, the ability to create text, but the ability to create graphics, that's the visuals, ability to create videos, and most importantly, your ability to create 3D models. Now, why is the 3D model so important? With the explanation of the metaverse, there will be need for people who are going to create the object, the 3D models that will exist in the metaverse. Because the metaverse is a virtual reality where you, are, you can actually live your life and have a second life in. But those objects, for example, if you want to play chess with your friend in the metaverse, somebody got to design the chess and create the 3D model of the chess. So your ability to create 3D models and 3D objects and be able to integrate it with the metaverse will be a very, very in-demand skill right now. It is not only going to be a skill that is at present in need, but a skill that is in the future will also be in very high demand. And your ability to move on to blend your different content from your videos to your 3D models to your text actually will create a whole lot of opportunities for you. Also, there is also a marketplace where you can even sell your 3D models. You can also sell your video footage or your photographs and things like that. So the whole content industry is a huge industry that any person who is wise enough is supposed to be able to learn to tap into. Last but not the least, the last career we're going to discuss is the blockchain engineer. Decentralization is taking over the whole world and blockchain is actually the key element that fuels the decentralization program. Everybody actually wants a decentralized system that makes things work. And different technologies can be built on the blockchain system, like smart contracts and different other uh, technologies. A blockchain engineer is so needed at this point because he is the one that can make this happen. He is the one who can actually be able to set up the blockchain and make sure that there is security in the blockchain in the first place. So that we don't have a blockchain that actually is, is something that is not reliable. The reliability of a blockchain and the technology that will be built on top of it is part of the responsibilities of a blockchain engineer. And this is a skill that is needed now and also will be so relevant in the future. If there is any skill or any career path you feel that should be in the top five of the list, please add it in the comment section. We will get, get your reply and reply you. Thank you.